We may be halfway through summer vacation, but we find ourselves in the heart of Minnesota's county fair season. With the Beltrami County Fair still a couple weeks away, judging for the fair has already begun. The sign reads Beltrami County Fair, August 8th through the 12th. And judging by the look of the fairgrounds, the commotion of a fair is still off in the distance. You would think there's still plenty of time before the big event, but not if you're one of the many members of the Beltrami County 4-H program. Take picture, okay? Already, hair, makeup, and last-minute alterations are being added because of judging for the fair has already begun. The Beltrami County 4-H'ers are going through and getting all their clothing and textiles projects judged. So anything that you're wearing, and not only is it clothes you make, it's also clothes you buy. Clothes that are altered and recycled were also included in the day of judging. But one of the aspects of early judging helps better prepare participants once the fair is here. Before 4-H members hit the Maryland Shutter stage here at the Beltrami County Fairgrounds, they're actually judged in a more intimate setting to help them prepare for the catwalk on the main stage. With the 4-H's standing for Head, Heart, Hands and Health, the purpose is education and learning new skills from the experience. Didn't know how to walk in, didn't know how to turn, and now I can walk in with my hands on my hips and put a little sass to it and be really confident in myself. For some, it's not only about learning. It's about being given the opportunity to showcase a cherished hobby and talent. I like to do clothes you make because I've been sewing for nine years since I was five. And clothes I buy, it's a good way. Well, I guess it's an excuse to buy clothes. But the skills and lessons learned through this experience go well beyond the county fair. They can take you all the way to the great Minnesota get-together. You learn basically how to talk to judges. You learn how to interact with the other girls. It gets you prepared because you learn what you can do differently at the state fair. With just over two weeks to go, you can bet these competitors will continue to practice and prepare to not only showcase the best in Beltrami County, but possibly the best that the state of Minnesota has to offer. Now the Beltrami County Fair runs August 8th through the 12th, and Lakeland PBS will be out there at the fair, and we'll be sure to continue to follow 4-H competitors for all over our viewing area, all the way down to the Minnesota State Fair. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.